Yo, what's up, everybody? Welcome to What You See Before You Hear, and I'm TD. I'm Matt. And we back again for another year of uh, new music, new covers, new new everything. 2021. We'll see what what's in store for new music this year. Hopefully, get some some fire ass new music. Something yeah. something different. So we get something different from a lot of the heavy hitters this year, from the Drake, the Gunners, the Roddy Rich. Um, but yeah, we're gonna go ahead and get into uh, some of those covers. You know, yeah. some of those those albums. What we think of that's gonna be the name. Well, we know some of the names, but what's gonna be the covers? How do the cover concepts with the things of that nature? First, we're gonna get into the Drake. Uh, yeah, Drake, Drake is definitely Drake. up there. Um, since Drake is confirmed, I mean, we could talk about that. Personally, yeah. I think he already started his rollout, so it's like we kind of already see what direction he's going in. Uh -huh. It just, with me, I'm trying to see, is he going to do photography or is he going to do, like, a type? Like, you know? Yeah. So that's what I'm trying to figure out. I feel like he either just going to do type or he going to do a photography of himself. Right. I mean, normally it's been the photographer of himself. Uh, I don't know. I wouldn't expect, I wouldn't expect nothing too different from Drake because I feel like he had a level where it's like, he ain't got to do nothing too crazy. It's Drake. You yeah. know what I'm saying? We're going to get it. We're going to yeah. get it. What you think about the music? I feel personally feel like the music is going to be like uh, more R&B-ish. I don't think it's going to be like... I doubt we hear any rapping on this album for some reason. I just I really feel like we're going to hear a lot of R&B. It's going to be a lot of Melanie's. Uh, he might have a couple features. Mm -hmm. But I feel like it's going to be more of an R&B album. Because I feel like now he he's reached a point where it's like... What else can you do now, Drake? And I feel like now it's like a whole R&B album. Yeah. If anything, I think he just got to get more people involved. Like, like so sonically, his stuff could sound. Like, if anything, he could just t touch bass. Like, he usually has. Yeah. Get more people from the reggae scene involved. Probably get some Afro beats. Yeah. But I think he should do it on a bigger scale. Like, the level he's at now, he should be on some, how can I put it? Not like We Are The World, but like, um... Um, like getting more bands and more people, like like uh, all of the saying. lights, I all get, of yeah, the lights. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like I'm, I'm gonna tell you what I mean. To hate to compare them to because hopefully he drop an album this year too. Kendrick, uh, that type of because he he be having so many people part of one song. Yeah, it's exactly. Like Done the cat, Amy Winehouse. It just be like yeah. So many. I think people. Drake got to do that to be a level like Drake do that with features and collab, and I think the people behind the scenes. But if yeah. he did that. As a cast, you know what I'm saying. Yeah. So, and um, shit, we could segue right into um, Young Thug. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. The the, the slime language. Since yeah, slime we talking language, about yeah. the cast and yeah. and you know they hold camp. Like um, we know that slime language gonna drop. So we just don't. What slime you think? language too. Yeah, slime language too. What you think about the cover concept? What you think it might oh, be? On the cover, dang. Because right. they're taking a trial. Them. Exactly. Because they're taking a trial. I was not them. expecting that concept. That, that, yeah. that was too far. And I wasn't expecting the last slime language. Like, it was cool. It was creative. I just didn't know they was going to do the, like, sign. Like, it was just so, like, it was just simplistic. But yeah, yeah to get the job done. Like, so I really don't know from their camp. I would think it would be more like a, uh, it'd be five. They did like a, uh, was it DC Marvel type of thing? Oh, okay. And they show like everybody on the roster type. That would everybody be fire. Everybody had like superpowers to it. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That'd be hard. Because everybody like, don't get me wrong, like I feel like everybody, they, they have the same energy, but everybody has in their group have a different little bit of yeah. sound. So they have a, everybody feeds off one super, one, one, one person, but they all still have their own sound. That makes yeah, sense. You know they've what I mean? created something like, yeah, definitely, yeah. that they all tapping into. And thinking about, uh, and since the, uh, we were talking about collabs, like the tape oh, yeah. like that. You said the, the baby. The baby, yeah. The baby. It would surprise me if the baby dropped, was it Billionaire? Billion, uh, billion, dollar, billion baby. dollar Baby. Like, they whole click. Like, I wouldn't be surprised because he got a squad and then he got four people. So, it's like, it only makes sense. Yeah, he like, could. You know, he can do that. Like, I feel like he, he don't have to drop an album. I would yeah. still expect him to drop an album because it's, it's the baby. He's been giving consistent albums, but... I can see that being. They really could. And yeah. and they they all dropping. They always dropping. So like this year, you know, a lot of artists, even though we doing predictions for a lot of cover uh, covers or projects we've been waiting on, mm -hmm. like them, you know they going to drop. So like you said, I think Tussie just joined. I think technically he might be under there. I don't think he's he's, not, a, he's under uh he's not under the not under the South label. Coast Music yeah, Group. Yeah, he under the whole Okay. Yeah, yeah. So wait, as far as been he been signing people? Cuz yeah, he been signing I ain't gonna people. Lie, if you going to say that. Baby been signing people too. Yes. Like Lil Baby been signing people. That, I mean, too. that's how I normally been in. It's like okay, 
QC, they sign on the QC, but I still have the right to, I still be able to create my own label with OPF, and now I can sign people. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's how it basically is. I definitely is. hear that. But it's so it's crazy to try to get people to actually be underneath his brand, because I think his brand, he made it so him. Yeah. That it's kind of like, dang, I don't want to be under it, because it don't seem like a group thing. Like, I know we're going to get money, but it seemed like your brand. It's not like YSL. Yeah, I feel you that. You see what I'm saying? Like... I, like even with TDE, it's like it feel like a group thing. Like you know what I'm kind of saying. Like yeah. like the name already kind of exhibit that. Like I feel like he will have much younger artists like that. He gonna sign a lot of younger artists gonna get underneath his brand. Yeah, I can see that. Same though. thing with Hancho Records. Like you naming a record after you. Yeah, you know. Uh, exactly. record. Record, yeah. yeah. So, but he got artists. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So I can see that. Yeah. Well, and then also for the like. Cover going to the cover, I feel like it'd be very simple. I don't think it'd be nothing crazy. I would oh, yeah, probably yeah. see the pictures of them. Yeah, pictures, pictures, pictures of them, or, whoever. Yeah. Or the actual like the logo of the label. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So I mean, you saying like that this. anyway? Shit, it ain't gotta just be underneath his label. Like since they got South Coast Music Group and all those people working together, fuck it, drop a collaboration album. Yeah. Put him, Black Zach, Two C, and um, I think PG Raw. He could fall underneath kind of that lane. Or I know, I feel like I'm. Oh, Stunner. I'm forgetting yeah, stop, yeah, stop. That's four people right there. Because yeah. I was like, who am I forgetting? Bro, that's four people. Yeah. You can literally use all four of their fan base. And with what 2C got, he bring the... the yeah. It's like MMG. When MMG did that oh, shit. Oh, yeah, yeah, and they ran that, was, that was so die. That was so crazy. Like <laughs> At that time. Yeah, period, exactly. And they was trying to sign Kendrick at that time, too. So oh, that, damn. that would have really went up. That yeah. Really so, crazy. Um, so, yeah, speaking of groups like, um, like Dreamville Camp. So, J. Cole going to be dropping, too. Oh, yeah. I think he's supposed to drop. Like, the big three dropping. Yeah, the big so, three dropping. Yeah, the, yeah. So, Drake, J. Cole. Kendrick. Kendrick. We don't know what Kendrick album going to be like. We really waiting on that one. Yeah. What's the, what's the, J, what's the name of uh, the J. Cole title? Is the, fall, the, the fall Fallout. The Fallout? The Fall Off? The yeah, the fall, fall Off. Yeah. Yeah, the Fall Off. Yeah. So, that one, like, what you think the album cover might be? I, I think it would be, I think it would be just a name. I don't think it's going to be him on the front. I don't, I really don't, I feel like okay. J. Cole is not going to do anything too crazy. Okay. Even just looking at, I don't know, I, I don't, I don't see nothing too, too creative going out the cover wise with J Cole on, on his, on his album. I don't feel. I like, like his artwork. I, I just do be like him. Whenever he, he, he drop the shit, it just be like J Cole, such a good artist. It's like him, Childish Gambino, like Travis Scott, because we gonna talk about that next. Speaking of big three, I feel like his dropping too, and he like, uh, yeah. he in a whole nother lane of his own self too. Yeah. So the Utopia dropping, that's interesting too. That's gonna be cr- man. I think about between uh, Travis Scott and Gunner to me, like they rollouts okay. so big this year. Well, last year, and I feel like those two rollouts. Gunner, he also said he's talking about dropping this year. More likely, he will. Yeah. Now, some of those artists, how you feel about artists dropping every year? Like you feel like that? Cause I know that's the that's the norm. But yeah. it's like, how you feel about them? Like, are they putting setting themselves up to like? do too much because that's why people on Trippy Head people have said that Trippy Red drop a lot of good music but he dropped so much that we don't appreciate him as I feel opposed that. to Cardi you know what I'm saying or Kendrick or like how Baby Keem even waiting like Ooh. it give you a more of like a you know it, yeah. it's, a, it's a um you you want more you know mm-hmm. like I, feel that. I, I mean it it all depends if they really growing as an artist because who wants to keep hearing the same thing? As a trip, as a trippy, I feel you that like I feel like Trippy has grown as an okay, artist. Okay, with each project, each project, yeah, is, facts, is definitely facts. So grown. that's why he can do so many. Yeah, and it's like you know, I feel like okay, a Cardi, I understand why he waited so long. Okay. He made us appreciate it, but then I, I mean, Cardi has elevated in in the last the, the last tape. You know what I'm saying? But I feel like. No, like a, you really, he's really grown as like Trippy has really grown as an artist. So people dropping back to back like that, you growing long, long as ain't nothing like. Yeah, cause, cause I feel like he's been doing it. Yeah, Gunna Gunna did been it. Doing, yeah. Gunna's gonna drop. Like Travis is gonna drop. Like and they grow as an art. They grow. Like, even the baby, I feel like. Yeah. Like people, some people get say they get tired of hearing the baby, but his music grows. Like he, he his his substance is kind of growing a little bit. Uh, yeah, I just. Personally, yeah. I feel like he's growing as I don't feel like it's no problem as long as it ain't like the same every time. Okay. Like you dropping. So what's some female artists like? Oh, I read. Oh, oh, you already know what I'm saying. I gotta say Rihanna. Oh yeah, that's that's long overdue. <laughs> that's long overdue. That's long overdue. Between yeah. Rihanna, and she dropped. That's crazy. Yeah, and I and I and I'm ready to hear what she gonna talk about. That's the crazy thing. Like. It, it, that's that's why I really yeah. want to hear what she's gonna, yeah, what what gonna speak on. It would make sense. She might as well drop this year. It'd be a lot of. I'm like, if what happened last year, 
the heavy hitters better drop this year. Yeah, like, yeah. It made no sense not to. Like even a scissor. Yeah, I yeah, like she's we, supposed yeah, to drop too. She just dropped. Something. I, I don't know, if Sweetie dropped, but I feel like the way Sweetie Brand going right now, she could drop a crazy album and everybody gonna buy that shit. Oh yeah, you know what I'm saying. Meg, like, you know Meg. We gonna probably yeah. get another Meg. Exactly. Uh, so. Um, Flo Millie just dropped the project. I feel like she could drop another one, mm-hmm. like, cause that's the thing about when you like drop a project and it do good. Like you see Rico, like keep it going. Yeah, like if you doing good and you know you an artist, you do you in the business, like you gonna keep making music. You yeah. know what I'm saying? You ain't got nothing else You're to not do. Gonna stop, Especially yeah. if you don't got no label holding you up. All right. You know what I'm saying? You could drop a mixtape and then drop an album. So it's hopefully like, too, we get us another Uzi. You know what? I'm gonna play it since it's a little, it's, it's down a little bit. It's there though, 32. Then I'm gonna play the SoundCloud bops. All SoundCloud. Everything when I drop my SoundCloud tape, it's gonna have all SoundCloud bops on there. Like bops, like SoundCloud bops, like real. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Ain't From what I heard, ain't that, ain't that, that probably gonna happen. Yeah. I don't know. I, th- I think Uzi had tweeted that he was gonna drop a, a project on SoundCloud only, bro. It don't make sense. I don't know. I got. We gotta see. We gonna pull that up. We yeah. gonna see you yeah, and see if we pull that up on screen on here. Right. But um, yeah. Um, it's a, it's a lot of people, and that's the thing. You gotta stay hip to like knowing people. Like Roddy Rich keep keep letting people know. Like I'm gonna drop soon. Yeah. Like um, when 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 uh Isaiah Rashad got something dropping. Is mm-hmm. the house is burning. But these people let you know the project name, and I find that interesting because they allow you to create already a world. Like, you see Utopia, everybody hyping yeah. it up, whole lot of red. It's like once you get that solid name, you yeah, can you literally do. do it so it build hype for when the cover finally come out. Thanks. And it's crazy. You you can have, like, 10, 8 of those because Young Thug is, is the king of that shit. Like, dude <laughs> yeah. will say, so high tune still high ain't tune. came out. Still ain't got high you know tune. what I'm saying? So that shit going to come out one day. Like, why not? Yeah. You know what I'm saying? You built the brand behind it. You kind of got it. You solidified it. So that's yeah. just something to think about. Like, yes. uh, Well, who you think going to have the best rollout this year? Oh, that's a good one. Because uh-huh. rollouts was crazy last year. Between Travis and Gunner, whew, that was that was. Why you say rollout. Travis? You talking about just his singles? No, nah, this the, roll, the rollout for the album. What Travis dropped last year? I mean, well, excuse me. It wasn't for the album. I'm tripping. It, that was my bad. That was for... Uh, I'm just talking about rollouts, period. Oh, okay. I'm just yeah, talking yeah. about just... I mean, as far as advertising, that man go crazy. Yeah. That's what you mean. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, rollout... Because if you think about, like, Gunner rollout was crazy. Yeah, you know, his shit was insane, whole, bro. You know, he went he went out of here. I wasn't expecting His shit is day. insane. I'm not going to cap you down. Yeah. Um, If they drop, of course, Rihanna's shit would have to be crazy. Yeah. Um, but, I mean, from a smaller perspective, um, let's really think about this. Yeah. From a, from a smaller perspective. Because you know what? That shit is real, bro. I feel like when you create the whole experience, mm-hmm. now, it's like that shit really matters. So I'm going to tell right. you. I'm, I'm going to tell you who I think, personally. Baby King. Oh, yeah. That's a good one. I think King's going to have a fire rollout. Yeah. Just because of what they've been doing with PG Lane. Oh, yeah. And like that whole, that whole little rollout facts. of things. It'd that's been, a good one. It's been having me thirsty because I've been like, what the hell is going on? What is this? Like, y'all got to give me more. I got to hear this. Mm-hmm. What's going on? Then he gave us a couple... Gave us, you know, a couple songs. Yeah. Since so. you dropping his name, I'll say Kenny Mason. Like, Oh, yeah, Kenny, yeah. Kenny Mason is like yeah, that shit for crazy. Real. Don't sleep on Kenny. His mysterious, like, that man, it crazy how he just be dropping. So, and I know his rollout's always crazy. Yeah, yeah. So, it's, it, we should start, start trying to mention a little bit more of the independent artists. Yeah. So, I mean, yeah. Let's and it, you know. they just be doing their job. Like, they, they, they do what they got to do. They stay out the way. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? I think it take a lot in order for you to, like, not go... You don't go too mainstream and you still got some mystery about you. Yeah. So it's like, Baby King, kind definitely. Of, yeah, balancing the, the both. Balance between both of them still. Yeah. yeah. Uh, I don't know, man. It's going to be a good year for music. I feel like it is. We've been... We've been waiting... For a lot of heavy hitters to drop, and glad they didn't drop last year. A lot of them didn't drop last year. Mm-hmm. Um, so yeah, man, we just yeah, y'all let us know though. Like we know we probably forgetting a whole bunch of people. Like we forgot Sway Lee. Yeah. He dropping Human Nature. It's so um, many people, we probably got forgot hella producers that probably got shit on the way. I think Must supposed to be dropping something, if I'm not mistaken. I wouldn't be I wouldn't be surprised if Mike Will drop something. Mm-hmm. You know, so. So, yeah, y'all just uh, drop a comment below. Let us know. Like, we really just on some organic shit. We're going to be on here a lot more now. Uh, tap in with us across all platforms. Um, 
Yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Make sure you follow us on um on Clubhouse. We got a couple clubs too. So uh yeah, make sure y'all tap in with that too. We'll put the name at the bottom right here. But yeah. All right. We out.